big news, ladies and gentlemen. You can now unjailbreak your iPhone without upgrading your iOS version. So that means you can remove your jailbreak and everything on your phone without actually upgrading iOS. It's really great, great tool. So I'm gonna show you here that I'm running iOS 8.4, which is a jailbreakable firmware here. So you can see iOS 8.4 there. And you see that I am jailbroken right now. I have Cydia installed on my device. I have a few jailbreak tweaks as well. But basically the long and short of the story is that Soric has released a new tool called Cydia Impactor that lets you restore your device, remove your jailbreak, and keep the same firmware so that you can jailbreak later if you want to. So here it is, Cydia Impactor. You can just search on Cydia for it. There's lots of detail about what this does, how it works, all that. So I do advise you to read that, but basically it's super easy to use. Now that being said, there are some things you definitely want to do. First, you want to make sure you're connected to the internet. You also want to make sure you have plenty of battery life and that you're connected to a power source just in case. And you also want to make sure your device is backed up. So you can use an iTunes backup or an iCloud backup. Make sure you back up if you wanna restore all of your data and stuff later. So once you launch Cydia Impactor, which is on your home screen, you'll see all these different reminders. I basically remind you about making sure you have plenty of power, make sure you're backed up, and then tap this button here, all right? And then you're gonna get this confirmation box. This is gonna delete all your data, so make sure you're backed up. Once you're sure, tap delete all, and then just let it run. Don't touch your device, don't close it, don't do anything to your device, just let it sit there, let it run through this, and what it's gonna do is it's going to basically remove everything from your device and restore a stock iOS configuration with the current firmware that you're currently on. This right now supports iOS 8.3 and iOS 8.4, and it is in beta, but I've tried it several times already, and I had great success all the times I tried it. Now I have sped this up about four times over, so it's gonna take a while to go through this, especially if you have a lot of apps and, and tweaks installed on your device. It's gonna take a while, but be patient, because what this is doing is doing something that's really remarkable, allowing you to keep your current firmware and basically remove all the stuff from your phone. So you're basically restoring to a stock iOS configuration without upgrading. This is very beneficial. Say you wanna sell your phone and keep the ability to jailbreak. Well, now you can do that with this. Say you, you wanna sell your phone, you don't want all your data on there. Normally what you would have to do is just restore if you wanted a, a clean sweep of your device, but that would mean that you would have to lose your ability to jailbreak usually because you're upgrading to the latest version of iOS, which isn't necessarily jailbreakable. So this allows you to do all that and keep your ability to jailbreak. So now once you're at the hello screen, it's basically just the normal setup that you would normally go through when you get a new iPhone or when you restore to stock. You even have to go through the activation again and set up everything. So location services. Now if you wanted to back up or restore your backup, you could do it right here from iTunes or from iCloud. So just keep that in mind. Um, just go through the normal setup process. Again, you don't necessarily need to be selling your phone. Like you could want to use this just in case you had problems with your jailbroken iPhone. Say you had some issues, maybe you downloaded some tweaks that kind of messed things up. Well, now you can just restore to a stock clean configuration and then just go back through and re jailbreak again. Pretty great tool. Again, it's Cydia Impactor, folks. Here it is. I am completely restored. Notice Cydia's gone. My wallpaper is changed back to stock. All the apps and tweaks are gone. I just go back into general and about, and you can see iOS 8.4. So I didn't lose my uh, firmware, and I was able to get rid of that jailbreak and unjailbreak. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. If you like this, please leave me a like. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.